Hello everyone, I'm Rob with ScrappyDoo.com and I'm just going to give you a short tutorial inside Inkscape on how you can create these simple flower designs so that you may want to save them as an SVG and import them into your favorite cutting program, whatever that may be. Now, believe it or not that these flowers were created with just basic simple shapes and they were created with stars. Now these stars that you see here correspond to the number of petals. So this one right here is six petals and I have six, have a six pointed star. Same thing with down here, I have an eight petaled flower. I have eight points. So in order to create a star, we just need to go over here to the create star and polygon. You need to make sure that you have star selected and then you can go ahead and draw your star. Then you can go up here and change how many corners you'd want as a star. Now, you have to decide how many petals you want before moving on to the next step because once we make this a path, you can no longer go back to it and change the petals because it is no longer a polygon shape that you can manipulate. They're all paths. All right, so the next tool you'll need is the Edit Path by Node. And I'm... I'm going to go ahead and work with that red star that we see over here. And we, we want this, this tool right here, Edit Path by Notes. Now we can select the star, and we want to go to Path, Object to Path. And we'll notice that we have these little gray dots on top of the points, and that's what we want to select. So we want to select that. And I'm going to hold the shift button down and select all the point tips. Now we need to change those nodes to some metric nodes that you see right here. It says make, make that node symmetric. All right, so now you can see that the, the star is already turning into petals. And you just want to stretch out those handlebars that you see on top of each one of those petals. All right, now to create the yellow uh, shadow border, you can do that in Inkscape as well. With the, with the shape selected, you can go to Path, and then we went to Linked Offset, and you can go ahead and drag up. And that is good. You can go Path, Object to Path, and you can change the color if you wish. So that's how that was created. And the circle is just a circle. And make sure you go to uh, Circle. Then you can go ahead and drag it over. And in order to make it a cuttable path, go Object to Path. So that is how, how I made this. And the same thing for this right here. I, I basically basically copied this layer so I went edit duplicate I rotated it and you can just give it another color to to make it look nice so that's about it on creating these simple simple flower like shapes in Inkscape so with that I'm Rob with Scrappy Doo make sure you subscribe and hit the thumbs up button if you enjoyed this video, thanks for watching.